This is tutorial number four, and it covers how to do dimension with an Autodesk Inventor. Now to start off, let's open up a brand new part file. Let's click File, click New, click Standard, click OK. Now we've already opened up our part file, and what we're going to do is we're going to sketch on this plane, and we're going to dimension our sketches. So to start off, let's draw out a rectangle. So let's click the two-point rectangle, and let's draw any rectangle. Now let's say that the rectangle that we drew, we actually want it to be a square. So what we'd have to do is we're going to have to click the general dimensioning tool. And we can dimension each. Let's make it 100. Click OK. And now we've dimensioned our circle to 100. Now, you don't just have to dimension the actual sketches. You can dimension the sketches from one another too. So let's say that we want this point of the circle to this point of the square to be 200 millimeters away. So we've already selected the dimensioning tool, so let's click the center point and this line here. And right now it's at 69, so let's double click on it and let's make it 200 millimeters away. Click OK. And now we've dimensioned the circle from the square 200 millimeters away. Now we can do this to any sketch that we draw so we can dimension the actual sketch and we can also dimension the sketches from one another. And that concludes our tutorial on how to dimension within Autodesk Inventor.